The Denver Broncos have named their interim head coach to replace the fired Nathaniel Hackett. What's up, guys? Welcome to Denver Broncos Syndicate, part of the Sports Syndicate family of channels where we are dedicated to bringing you content about our favorite sports teams. I am your host, Gage Madrid. So earlier this morning, it was announced that the Denver Broncos have parted ways with head coach Nathaniel Hackett following their 59-14 blowout loss to the Los Angeles Rams on Christmas Day. This was a move that clearly had to be made. The Broncos were last in the NFL in total offense. Russell Wilson has clearly regressed this season. On top of that, the Broncos lead the NFL in penalties and have looked clearly like the worst coached unit in the entire NFL. When you couple that with all the sideline spats and everything else that was happening yesterday in the Rams game with all the frustration boiling over with Randy Gregory, Brett Rippon, Dalton Reisner. It was pretty clear that Nathaniel Hackett had lost the locker room and the team needed to make this move sooner rather than later. So that now leaves the question, who will coach the Denver Broncos for their final two games of the season? A few minutes ago, this was tweeted by Broncos insider Mike Kliss. Source confirms Broncos will make game day operations advisor Jerry Rosberg interim coach for final two games. Rosberg, a longtime Ravens special teams coordinator, will oversee all three phases while coordinators run each phase. Evero on defense, Kubiak and Outen on offense, and Stukes on special teams. Now, if you guys don't remember, Jerry Rosberg was the coach that Nathaniel Hackett brought in earlier in the season to help oversee game management. He was having some issues with clock management and how to use his timeouts and all that other stuff early in the season, so he brought in Jerry Rosberg to kind of help oversee that operation and make sure that all the game management stuff was done cleanly. Now Rosberg is going to take over that role on a full-time basis. Again, the Broncos' three coordinators and their de facto offensive coordinator, Clint Kubiak, are all going to be having their respective roles retained. Kubiak will still call the plays on offense. Justin Outen will still be involved in however he's been involved these past few weeks in offensive game planning and all that stuff. And then Ajiro Evero will still run the defense for the next few weeks. And then Dwayne Stukes obviously will take care of the special teams. So now the question becomes, who is Jerry Rosberg? He started his career as a coach at Boston College back in 1997 as a secondary coach. He then moved on to Notre Dame as a quarterbacks coach and special teams coordinator. And then his first break in the NFL came in 2001 when he took over as the Cleveland Browns special teams coordinator. He served seven seasons in that role before moving on to Atlanta for one season as their special teams coordinator. And then he went to Baltimore where he served as their special teams coordinator for many years. And as we all know, during his tenure in Baltimore, he aided in the development development of Justin Tucker, the greatest kicker in the NFL right now. He also aided in the development of punter Sam Cook and long snapper Morgan Cox. That was an operation in Baltimore that was completely sound. Also, their coverage units were fantastic. And Rosberg was also involved in some game management strategies with Baltimore during his tenure there. He then retired as Baltimore special teams coordinator back in 2018, but Nathaniel Hackett had brought him out of retirement to serve as a game management advisor for the Broncos. Now he takes over as the Broncos interim head coach. At the end of the day, I feel like this was probably the smart hire. You've got a veteran coach in Rosberg in the building who's clearly familiar with the game management stuff and he can manage all of that while not having to put any more pressure on a guy like Ajro Evero, who the fans and the media alike wanted as the top candidate for the interim head coaching job. The next two weeks are definitely going to serve as an audition for the Broncos coaching staff. I think there's a strong chance for Ajro Evero to be retained, but but the rest of the coaching staff needs to make a strong case to be retained next season. Again, I think it's going to be a complete house cleaning on offense, but I do believe that the front office will make a strong lobbying to whoever the next head coach of the Denver Broncos is going to be to keep Adriel Evero on board as the defensive coordinator next season. But time will tell what happens there. All right, guys, here we go. We didn't think that this was going to be when we started this offseason, but entering this next offseason, we're going to have yet another head coaching search. I do believe that Russell Wilson is going to be here for the next couple of years because of the financial obligations. So we clearly need to find a coach who is going to make the best out of Russell Wilson these next couple of years. Be it Dan Quinn, be it Jim Harbaugh, be it D'Amico Ryans, I don't know. 
maybe even Sean Payton, but that's somewhat unlikely just because the New Orleans Saints still hold his contractual rights. And reports surfaced yesterday that Sean Payton wants Vic Fangio on his potential staff as defensive coordinator. So clearly that wouldn't work out too well here in the Mile High City. But time remains to be seen. Let me know, Broncos country. How do you feel about the Broncos hiring Jerry Rossberg as the interim head coach for the final two seasons? And who do you think is the strongest candidate to replace Nathaniel Hackett moving forward? Forward. Drop those comments down below. I would love to hear from you. Be sure to leave a like on this video as well as subscribe and ring the bell so these videos appear in your notification feed. And while you're at it, be sure to follow me on Twitter at Gage Madrid NFL so you don't miss any immediate Broncos coverage. And for now, this has been another episode of Denver Broncos Syndicate. I am your host, Gage Madrid, saying peace out. Peace out.